Hello and welcome back to Mountain Blade Warbands Floris Mod. I'm your host, Arnold the Singer. Well, after taking Grunwalder, I thought I would uh, continue the video with Ergelion, but I decided to stop playing that day. You know, I was a little tired. Anyway, I sent all of my lords over to Ergelion, uh, equipped them with a few troops from Grunwalder, but then I saw several Rodok lords and King Graveth himself coming this way. Now, I still have a bunch of guys following me from Jelkala, who did not participate in Grunwalder's assault. Now, I'm going to take out Doge Graveth and fight whatever lords he happens to have sent towards Ergelion. Hmm. Grunwalder, Ergelion. Wow, I've been busy these last uh, couple in game days. All right, let's take out Doge Graveth with my army. We meet again, Arnold the Singer. <laughs> you have something that belongs to me, Jelkala. I will make you relinquish it. What is it? Ha, <laughs> huh. hmm, yes. Uh, should I have given him such a guttural... Scottish accent? I don't know. Do I want peace? Hmm. Do I want peace? No. I say this once, Joe Graveth. Surrender or die. As you wish. Prepare to die. I think I outnumber him. I have quite a few good troops in my party. My other lords have varying units, but this should be fun. <laughs> oh, I should have put my elephant riders near the top. I'll have to deal with the slave crushers. Hmm. You know, I should just keep them at the top, you know, until they're down to about 20 men, maybe. Wow, they are tough. The first wave is always tough. And there's a reason that the first wave is tough. They need to get advantage so that when the good troops are dead, the weaker ones will have a chance against whatever's left. But I don't have big troops. I am just filled with the good ones. Come on, come on. And here we have more Rodoks. Before the archers pepper me. I guess we're getting close to their spawn area. <laughs> I got him. Ooh, haha. <laughs> Lagging just a bit. Hmm. Hmm. Wrong side of the horse. <laughs> Thank you. 
It's hard to see through all that script of, you know, people dying. <laughs> need to control my speed more. Hmm. Damn it. Wrong swing at the wrong time. Oh well, Slave Crusher got him. Victory is ours. Well, not yet. Only half a victory. <laughs> Two more waves, I assume. I need a longer blunt weapon. It deals a fair amount of damage, but I prefer a little length. No elephants. <laughs> We are doing rather well. Now they're holding the ground. In truth, this is a wise decision for them, considering their numbers. But the sheer power of my own troops will demolish them. This foliage is not very good for our horsemen. I'd best follow them. There they are. See, not good for the horses. <laughs> or me. <laughs> There's some more. I'll get into the thick of it so I can crush them. <clears throat> well, that was a very good battle. Very few casualties, all things considered. And the last wave. I don't think they're going to win. There it is. <laughs> oh, probably won't be able to get any kills now. What a shame. I'll be lucky. I'll be lucky if I get one kill. There's probably a ton of recruits up here. Oh, maybe I will get a kill or two.
Okay. Not bad. A few rescued prisoners. I'm going to have to get rid of a few of these guys. Hmm. You know what? Maybe I'll let one of my companions take all of these. Send whoever has it down to Nara or something. That's a good idea. Hopefully they obey my orders and don't screw with me. <laughs> Decent sword. But nothing I really need. Let my companions take it and take it out of their inventory when I go somewhere else. Well, all of my lords seem to have enjoyed the battle. No one took the prisoners. Oh, wait, wait. Barans has them. Good Barans. <laughs> You're the one I want to increase the most. I won't forget the great battle near Grunwalder Castle when we broke through the enemy lines and they ran screaming before us. It is a sweet memory. I want you to go to Nara. Good for you. And the rest of them I will send over to Rybelt. They may attack some forest bandits. Then I will go to Agelion, and you will see all of that momentarily. Okay, we're back. Together, you and I can take Agelion, Lord Hamazon. You should assault immediately. <laughs> Very well, to the wars. Okay, this is a tough fortress, but not tough enough. Let us join the assault. Hmm. Put my slave crushers near the top. They are an archery type, so I will keep them here. I've classified them as elephants. Well, a galleon looks much the same. one elephant rider there. Hmm. I guess he doesn't have a bow and arrow. Last time I checked I thought they did. <laughs> hmm. Charge then. Looks as though we've taken the wall. Wow, we are just overrunning them. Archers. 
held this position. Uh, we are going to massacre them. a small castle. Well, we do have overwhelming numbers on our side, whereas the defenders of a fortress can only generate so many, which makes sieges mm, far too easy, in my opinion. Oh well, what can you do? Let's take out the remaining defenders. Hmm. Right. Good job, everyone. Right. Not this fool. <laughs> We've won. Well, I'll only take a hundred from there. While I was off screen, I received a financial report. Apparently, I lost about 14,000 dinars because, well, my productive enterprises aren't making very much. And, um, well, I've taken several other fiefs, so. I need to garrison them too. Anyway, I'm going to tell all of my soldiers to go toward Rybelt, where perhaps they will attack a forest banded army or something. I'll deal with that, uh, lead another force up to the mountains to deal with some mountain bandits. And go back to Nara, have some fun. I think I'll leave the Sea Raiders where they are over in the Nord territory. I kind of want the Nords to have problems because they're too big and I don't want to fight only one faction. Hmm. Sovereign relations. Or perhaps I will try provoking the Saranid Sultanate. Cast a spelly thing. Hmm. The Saranids, however, may feel threatened by the Nords. Hmm. Not surprising, though. The Nords are very much profiting from their alliance with me. Hmm. I'll have to deal with them at some point. I don't think the other factions have it in them to defeat the Nords. No more alliances, I think. Anyway, 
I do hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. See you then.